That's the voice of San Antonio police officer Jonathan Berlanga. He was driving 80 miles per hour on Blanco Road with no lights or sirens. I got 7600 Blanco. Lady turned right in front of me. Uh, hit her on the passenger door. The um, EMS hasn't gotten here, so we don't know what condition the driver, but she's she's unconscious right now. She's still breathing though. The driver was 25-year-old Vanessa Samudio. She lived, but she suffered permanent brain damage. I was in the hospital for about a month and a half. And I did therapy, like physical therapy, um, occupational therapy, speech therapy while I was in there. But also I did outpatient therapy for about three months. For the city of San Antonio, it was the most expensive accident in the past decade. The city keeps a database that tracks every single insurance claim filed against it. It's a litany of the trivial and the tragic. People complain about garbage trucks denting mailboxes, and they file lawsuits over fatal accidents. City officials say safety programs help reduce the number of claims. At the city department that handles garbage collection, they install dash cam videos to monitor drivers and where they're going. Texas law protects cities. Depending on the facts, San Antonio can be immune from any claim for money. In Samudio's case, a city investigation faulted her and Officer Belonga for the crash, but it concluded that Belonga's high speed caused the wreck. The city doesn't have to pay more than $250,000 to people like Samudio. What she got barely covered her medical bills. Well, how do you feel about the fact that under state law, when this happens with a city vehicle like a police car, uh -huh. the maximum amount of money that anybody can get, like yourself, is $250,000. That's the max. Even if you die. Even if you die, even if you are comatose forever, mm -hmm. I mean, that's the max. Mm -hmm. uh, what are your feelings about that cap? I don't like it. Yeah. Because I don't think it's fair. Yeah, you know, even if you die, like, they'll just give you the max to your family or, I mean, it's just not enough to what they put you through or what you had to go through. You can visit MySA.com to read more about Vanessa Samudio, check out the city's insurance file about her accident, and view the city data for yourself.